Hi everyone, this is Joseph from Forest Tech Reviews, aka your favorite Cajun tech reviewer, back with another video. Today's video, yes, I have another case for your Galaxy Z Fold 4, but before I get into this review, check this out. Okay everyone, so I'm back with another video today. Today's video, yes, I have two more cases for your Galaxy Z Fold 4. They come from a case company called Caseborn. If you haven't heard of them, they're a small company based out of Texas. Caseborn actually came from a company he had before, Armadillo Tech. But they make cases for like Galaxy's iPhones. I have reviewed a lot of cases from them on my channel. He has been working on this Z Fold 4 case for a while now. There's something unique about it. And I'm going to show it off in this video. Now, these cases are like the Case Born V. This one actually has pen support or pen holder in the hinge protection. And then this one is just a normal case without the pen support. I'm putting this video out on Cyber Monday. So if you're watching it that day, you can actually pick up the pen support cheaper than you can do the other case. So... The one with the pen support is normally $99. For Cyber Monday, it's $60. And then this one is normally $69, and it still is $69. So, we will get into it. Let's check out the one with the pen support. We'll make sure everything lines up, make sure everything fits well. There's something unique about the hinge on here, as you can tell. It's not just your normal hinge protection case. And here it is. I kind of like that orange color. does have a kickstand. It comes with a bunch of goodies. You have a screen protector for the front, the main, the outer display, I should say. Some wipes there, extra strips, and a little note from Case Bond. The one thing, yes, it does have strips on here. You know, we know how we feel about strips, but for the purpose of the video, we're going to try to take these off just to see how it fits overall. Now, this is a heavy duty case. You can, you're not going, if you drop it, you're not going to break your phone and it should help you protect it. But you can see a little brand in the inside. The hinge is just made different. It has like a different design to it. And then the pen is in here. My pen is already in there. Which is actually pretty cool. But let's see how this bad boy fits. All right, so I was able to get the case on there and it fits really good around these corners. So it's a little tight. And the, the adhesive strips do work. I can't really pull this case out of, I mean the phone out of the case. Let's go around the case. I do like how it has the extra grip on the sides. The volume rockers and the power, I mean the volume rockers are closed up. The power button is there. It's still easy to get to the power button. The volume rockers feel nice and easy to press. Not, I mean, they're responsive, so. You do get camera protection. You get a lot of camera protection. Also that lay down protection or lip action. You definitely get that. The holes at the bottom line up. Everything at the top lines up. The pen is still in there. So if you need it, you can just pull it out. Maybe. If you had nails, everything works better with nails. And then you can just put it right back in there. Now, the unique thing about this design is that hinge protection there. Now, this will add bulk to your phone. As you can tell, you add in this big old pen holder there. So, it's going to add bulk, but it's, I mean, it's not too bad. Can you get to the, you can get to the edge protection there too, or edge panel. But what y'all think about it? The kickstand is hard to get open, so that actually works pretty good too. But the, 
the thing that makes this case unique is the hinge. So when you open it up, normally on any other case, when you open it up, the hinge will be halfway covering it up. This one, it doesn't. It gives you something extra to hold too. So just like that, it gives you something to hold, but your front display is open. You don't have to worry about getting it blocked. Now on the kickstand, let's see how good that actually works. Can work like that. You can also work like that if you wanted to. Not like that really, that stands on the Can you wash it like this too? Yeah, so if you don't want to open up your display, it will work like that too. And this, the kickstand is sturdy. So what y'all think about that hinge? I know he was been working on this design for a while. And I think, he, I think it's pretty good. You know? I think it's pretty good. I do like the grip on here, so that's always a good thing. The extra grip on here is great. Can you wireless charge? Let's see. I don't know. With this big back here, you may not be able to. And actually, you can. Now, will you be able to do, like, the wireless share charging? Probably not. But you can definitely wireless charge your phone and i like how that power button is covered in the volume rocker i mean the power button is open but the volume rockers are covered but let's move on to the one without the pen holder in there that is i like that too all in one i think other few case companies have that design too but the hinge is where it's at look at that how it just folds over each other that is definitely unique but I'm going to come back and we will get to the other one without the pen support and see how that one looks. All right, so here is the black one, but this one does not have the pen support. So you can tell right here that this is a little bit smaller. I kind of like this one without the pen support because I'm not a big user on the pen. So... I can carry the pen if I wanted to, but I do like this one. It doesn't have as much bulk as that one does, but the design is the same. The power button you can get to. The volume rockers feel great. No problem there. You get that same camera protection here and also the lip action all the way around. You just don't get the pen holder in the hinge, but you get that hinge protection. And just like the orange one, it doesn't cover that main display. And it gives you something to hang on to when you're using it like this. The hinge is where the design is at. Doesn't rock really too much. Everything lines up to just like the same thing. It has that grip. I do like the grip on here. I do definitely like the grip. Top lines up. You get lip action all the way around. I didn't show that on the orange one, but it's the same design. So you get that lip action too. And the case is snug with the adhesive strips. What y'all think about this one? The kickstand works the same. I mean, you can work it like that. You can do it like this. Or if you want more of an up angle. But it works. It's sturdy too. It's definitely not a cheap one. Like some case manufacturers do. Can you wireless charge? I don't think you will have a problem. Again, you can wireless charge without any issues there. But I do like this one just because it is a little, a little less bulkier than, say, the orange one. But that hinge there, look at look how it opens. It kind of folds over itself. So I know he's been working on this design for a while, so that's actually pretty good. 
But I will have the links in the description if you want to pick up this one. Or maybe you like the orange one with the pen support and the holder in there. It's definitely up to you. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, make sure you do so for more coverage on the Galaxy Z Fold 4. Also, make sure you follow me on Twitter at Forza Reviews. Become part of the BAM Nation. And until next time, peace. I'm out of here. Y'all have a great day.